you know, I had um, Corrupt on the show, and we were just talking about you couldn't really know Tupac without eventually bumping, bumping heads, heads. bumping <laughs> heads with him. So tell us about the craziest thing that you ever got into it with him about. Because oh, I'm, Lord. I know it's been a million things. Just something that's funny. Okay, now or stupid. Well, this wasn't funny. Okay, it this wasn't was funny. serious. All right, and he was adamant about it. I mean, as always. And he um, he really um. He, when he came to death row, he, um, he was, he was fueled. He had, he had, he had, he was on a mission. Right. So. As were you? Yeah, no, this was a different mission. Oh, okay. Um, he oh, was he was on, on a, that bullshit. Yeah, he was, a, it wasn't <laughs> bullshit to him. Right. I mean, it wasn't bullshit to me. Out, but, so he but, but, yeah. but he had a, he had a bone to pick and it was with, um, uh, bad boy and, a lot of people on the East Coast. Right. So his thing with me was, he. We, I was in the studio one night and he came, and before that he was like he would mess with me, flirt with me. He was like, Rage, I don't like big girls, but it's something about you." And, mm-hmm. right. and you know he was playful and all, but this one particular time he was like, "Yo, Rage, um, he's like you the weak link." No. Oh. Now, no, I didn't take it. I didn't take it. Yeah. Because I said I'm the weak link. He mm-hmm. said, "Yeah, you the weak link on death row," and I was like, "Why is that?" He's like, because you was the only motherfucker standing up for them niggas at the Source Awards. Right. Mm. So I said, hmm, I don't mm. think that makes me the weak link. I think that makes me the strong link because I wasn't going to let what anybody else, I'm doing me. And right. that's all I can do. And in the end, he eventually respected that. He tried to get me to do, you know, not get me to do, but he was trying to, you know, t- tell everybody what was going on these niggas tried to kill me and that's what he believed and that's what he felt right and then he wanted me to diss little kim and foxy brown and he was like you don't think them bitches are diss you rage and i was like yeah. well if they uh, can i curse yeah oh <laughs> no going to town. i guess you Too already late now go for it. Did it. Go ahead. so you know go for what you know it, it was like um he's like don't come get me uh when them bitches come and diss you i said well if they do I can fight my own battles. I don't have to try to recruit an army to fight my battles like some motherfuckers. Right. So it was just a back and forth thing. And then-